At 16 years old, Kismekia Corbett was a high school student in North Carolina, telling people she was going to be the first black woman to win the Nobel Prize in medicine. After all, she was excelling in advanced courses that would prepare her to go on to earn a BS, an MS, and a PhD. Dr. Corbett hasn't won the Nobel yet, but she has saved millions of lives as one of the scientists behind the COVID-19 vaccines. Like a young Dr. Corbett, there are many Black and Latino students who enjoy science and want to pursue it as a career. And more than half of STEM college students said they decided on a major well before they graduated high school. So, why are so few Black and Latino students enrolled in advanced placement STEM courses? Nearly a quarter million Black and Latino high schoolers are missing out on AP courses they should otherwise have fair access to. Many schools that serve large populations of Black and Latino students don't have enough seats in advanced courses, and racially diverse schools often don't fairly enroll Black and Latino students. A positive school climate includes positive relationships among and between staff and students, a safe environment where students feel they belong, and equitable supports to meet high expectations. This leads to higher enrollment in AP classes, regardless of school size or the proportion of Black and Latino students within the school. State, district, and school leaders need to implement policies that remove barriers that prevent Black and Latino students from accessing AP courses. For example, make registering for AP courses automatic, so students have to opt out rather than opt in. Overall, school environments need to be safe, inclusive, and welcoming for Black and Latino students. When given access to rigorous courses, all students can be challenged to reach their full potential. For more information, visit edtrust.org slash APSTEM.